and begin to understand something, that when you are committed to multiplying, you're putting a teleological uh, trajectory out there that you've got a place to go. And you're so afraid of losing these great leaders, but the truth is you're gonna lose them if you don't have a place for them to go. And so to me, it was about telos, other than randomness. Randomness works sometime, but this Newtonian randomness is not what I felt the church plan was about, and I've seen it before, so I wanted to commit and tell my church and begin to talk about it and see these young leaders have a hope in saying, I'm going to be one of those people who, who does a multi-site. I'm gonna be one of those people who goes to a small town. I'm gonna be one of those people who, who do this and to get excited about it. To me, it's not hard to give away what you're gonna lose anyhow, because God has put it in their hearts and you wanna see it come alive. So as a pastor, how can you step in the way of something God's doing in their life and they did in your life? You got the chance, why not give them the chance? There's room for more. We do it different. There's a flavor for a reason and it ought to be here and a chance to, for people to come and, and see what God is doing to the vineyard. Join us in multiplying your church.